What's up guys, today I got a pretty cool video that I wanna share with you. Normally, I'm not a fan of headlamps, but today I found one that is pretty cool. It's got some great features that's gonna help you out around the shop. So you guys stick around, cause you are going to want one of these. All right, guys, like I mentioned in the intro, normally I'm not a fan of headlamps. Normally they're just kind of awkward and I'm just really not a fan of them. But part of the reason why it's always seemed like it's hard to find the buttons to turn them on and off and use the functions and features that they offer. Well, that's kind of all changed now with the way technology has come out with and Observer Tools has come out with a pretty cool headlamp that's going to help you guys, especially if you wear gloves and you want to brighten or dim your work light depending on the area that you're in. Um, real quick before we start this video, this was sent to me by Observer Tools to review for you guys and I've used this thing for about five days now and I've become a huge fan of it and I wanna share it with you guys and show you some of the cool functions and features. The first thing I do wanna throw out there, I'm a huge light addict. If you guys have watched my channel for a while, you know that I'm really big into lights I'm a firm believer if you can't see, you can't work on what you need to, right? So when they sent me this, I was like, eh, I'm just not a headlight kind of guy, you know. I've always had issues, I wear gloves, you know, turning it on and off's always been a pain. They've got several ways that you can operate this light, actually three different ways that you can turn it on and the battery life on it's amazing. So let's get in here and let me show it to you guys because the price point of this light is only 40 bucks. Yeah, 40 bucks for a rechargeable headlamp. It's got a ton of features that you guys are gonna enjoy. So let's take a look at it. Obviously this is the package that it comes in. When you order it, like I say, the retail cost of this lamp is $40, four zero. That's a bargain for a rechargeable headlamp. But anyway, some of the cool features, you know, it's got the, the headband like most of them do with the, you know, like the silicone grip that's made inside it that keeps it from slipping on your head. It is adjustable so you can pivot it down. Um, but if you'll notice on the top, it's got two different mode switches. It's got a knob on the side. So let me explain to you why I say this is a really cool headlamp, especially if you're wearing gloves. Um, you know, it's always hard to feel and find the buttons on them. This will work like any other headlamp. Um, but what's cool is I just pressed the motion sensor button that's right here on it. And when you wave your hand in front of it twice, it will come on. So if you're wearing thick gloves, like thick work gloves or winter gloves or anything like that, you can turn your headlamp on by simply waving your hand in front of it twice. You want to turn it off? do it again, it goes off. That's a really cool feature and that's what made me kind of fall in love with this headlamp over the different kinds of headlamps in the past. Just simply move your hand in front of it, bam. It's on and off. On, two times, and it's off. All right, so if that's not cool enough for you, it's got the regular manual button like we always see on any other headlamp. One clicks 100%, two clicks 50%, third click is off. Now that's pretty cool, but if you're wearing thick gloves, it sucks to try to find and mash a button. So you can turn the knob and it's completely dimmable by the side. On high, it's 350 lumens and that will give you six hours of runtime. That's super impressive. And on the lowest setting, it's 35 lumens, and that will give you 15 hours of runtime. So you can adjust it and turn it on and off with a knob on the side, and you never have to mess with the button on the top. Super cool features and functions that's in this light. Um, so you got three different ways to turn it on. You press this button, and it works with the motion sensors, and that's on high, and obviously you can dim it, you know, if you need to. But two times and it comes on, two times and it goes off. 
And if you spread your fingers out, one wave will get it like that. <laughs> so, you know, you can you know play with it and see how you turn it on and off. But the charge time on it is three and a half hours when it's completely dead. As you can see, the little blue LED is on, indicating that the motion sensor is on on the light. Press the button and that goes off. But it's um, 350 lumens on high, 35 on low, six hours runtime on high, you know, um, 15 hours on low. It's pretty impressive. 40 bucks. Um, it does have a charging indicator when you plug it up on the bottom. If you'll notice, it does have the um, micro USB charging on it. That is the only complaint that I have with this light at all. I'm not a fan of micro USBs. I think they suck because you have to pay attention when you put it in, you know, make sure you get it in the right way. And if it's dark, it's always hard to see that. You know, I would love to have seen this with a USB-C charging port but it's got a micro USB. It does come with a cord and all that stuff so you can charge it, but it's 40 bucks, guys. It comes with a 30 day, um, you know, pretty much money back guarantee. If you don't like it, you send it back to them, but it comes for a lifetime warranty for the craftsmanship of it. So be sure to check these guys out, Observer Tools. I'll put a link below and that way you guys can go to it. But like I say, they sent me this and normally, you know, like I say, I'm not a headlight fan, but when they sent that and it's got the motion sensor, I really like that function because it's always, when you're wearing a headlamp, it's because you're in a bad situation, right? So your hands are usually muddy and nasty if you're doing plumbing work under the floors or anything like that, or if you're up in an attic working, you know, it's always hard to feel around. Like here, you know, we just run some ethernet cables. We had insulation all over us. Headlamps are great, but it's always a pain to turn off. This feature really makes it awesome. And for 40 bucks, you really can't complain at all about the price. So anyway, that's it guys. That's the video. That's the headlamp. That's Observer Tools. Check them out. Like always guys, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up and click that subscribe button. It's free. It never costs you not one single dime. You guys have a great week and we will catch you next time. Go check out these lights. They're pretty cool.